Hello guys and welcome back. You may have noticed I'm actually a few days behind where I was last time. That's because I started the next six video recording session while forgetting to record. So I was about two minutes in. I um, did that thing where I went, oh, did I actually record? I actually went out and checked. Turns out I wasn't and I'd actually forgot to say between sessions. So I think I'm two weeks behind, which is not a fuss at all. I've just got to go over here. I am going to have my vengeance on Violet. I'm going to go into her house, I'm going to break in, and I'm going to slaughter her. Yes. Totally. So, what I did notice is that Catelyn here is only the heir to the Riverlands. So it's actually a separate heir to the Westlands. So there's a bit of an issue over there, but anyway, um, we have nothing to worry about that. We're just going to go through and sort these things out. So my daughter, Arwen, she is 14 and she is a diplomat. So there you go. My current son and heir is 11 and needs to be forced trained, but when can he? 26th of July. My other son? 20th of September. My third son, Rickard, is 2. Brandon is 9 and wounded. Looks like we're going to get a good heir out of these kids. I mean, he's already got better stats than me. He just needs to get his martial up and he'll be alright. But we'll get a martial up when he starts learning how to fight. Look at that health as well from being a formidable fighter. I'm going to live quite an old life, and I'm already 30, which is, you know, just sort of the level you go Starks, 30, 40, 40, 29, 39, oh, we actually got a 52 here. We got an 83 year old, Kregan. Oh, but he was a formidable fighter. Uh, black sword, you say. He had a few children. John of one eye has two eyes. His initial air. Is that the sensor? 821? No, it's not. Rickon. Married at Mandalay, did you? And you had these kids, you had Craig and Stark. There's all this family line, all these people die out. Yeah, Starks, you married a. Ah, Osric Umber. Harmons, that guy. Brun, Bors. Did you all go to Nice No, just him. No, oh, you're in still at the Nice Watch. Anyway, yeah, let's get on with it. So I have these guys going south. Yes. Oh shit, I've crashed. Well, that didn't last long, did it? Jeez, what the hell? That didn't last long at all. This is. What the? What was that all about? Wait, now, now you want to be all like, Steam is not responding. Oh, well, fuck you, game. I've got to reload Steam, so I'm going to cut all this future stuff out, I hope. Hey, so sorry about that. It's just Steam being a dick. Oh, well, Steam and the game in general. The game crashed and then Steam decided to be a dick and make me have to reload the whole thing. So, yeah, I'm not doing a whole intro again. I'll just simply click through this to get it out of the way. Sweet. So, people owe me favours. Important decisions available. Next sort of subjects. Right, Rick, on this time, can we not die or game crash? I should say. Yeah, why am I saying die? Can we not game crash this time, Rick? On? Fucking idiots. That doesn't appear so. When did it crash last time? Imagine that as well. Fucking dying to her. Ha 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 Yes, in the Riverlands. Oh, she married a uh, a Malister. How is my house Malister doing? Is that the Jason over there? That's Greg on the mountain that rise. This is Joffrey Malister. He was slain by whom? Ah, excuse my areas. Ryman. Where's the? Oh, this is Jason the kind. He went to nice watch. Okay, and Patrick took over. Hollis. Is the current heir. Okay, well, we're about to arrive. Why have we got a tradition here? Seriously. And a child needs a guardian. Oh, no, she needs to be educated. There's uh, Princess Leonie. She's going to be tutored in the etiquette. And is she old enough to be educated somewhere else yet? She's really sick. She'll be fussed off somewhere. Is my other daughter actually fussed off? Yeah, she's at... Over here with Howland Reed. Right. Oh, we should really be working on betrayals with these kids. That will help get my people liking me. They currently hate me quite a bit. Uh, so what have you got here? You've got an 11-year-old. You've got a 3-year-old. 
That's your heir. I have a 14-year-old daughter here. Right. Uh, your second son. I'm going to travel between him and my daughter Arwen, please. Very good. I also have my son and heir, but he can wait. He's a boy. Boys can wait. My second son, though, is nine. What other houses do we like? We like House Bolton at the moment, do we? Any girls? No. Glovers? We've got a sibling who is 13. That's a bit too old. You guys don't have any heirs yet. You're just a couple of dudes. Flynn? No, I don't care about Flynn's. Risewells? I don't like the Risewells as much. The heirs are currently Roger. He's got a daughter who's 12. Maybe Patrick's nef uh, niece. Screw that. Uh, there is the Wolves. Lyanna Wool. Right, let's get a betrothal between you and my nine-year-old Brandon. That's to get relations up with this kid. He's currently at a 12. Let's see where he goes to after this. Right, so you're currently next to over eight. That knocks you up to a two. And he's got a strong claim on the Lordship of the Rills. Lordship of Cherwell. Most Kaelin. Yeah, he really wants to expand Lord Galbart. Good for you. Alright, accept your suggestion of betrayal. Right, that gets him up a bit. There you go, you've got a little bit of extra relations. I have another two kids I could fire off to other people if I did so wish. And there is a few Bolton males. Maybe one of these for my daughter. I mean, he's four. He's six. The heir to house Bolton. Good betray of you to my five year old. That'll make him like me more. He's going from a 23 to a 33. That's a big improvement. Yeah, I'll take that. Sweet. Right, so let's have a look at our laws now that we are independents. Controlled realm inheritance. Passing the controlled realm inheritance law will protect titles within realm by. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, so people outside of our realm will not inherit our lands. So we're not going to have, like, the north suddenly lose that province to the Vale or something stupid like that. The Realm Authority. I don't care about the Realm Authority right now. First Knights can be made legal. Supporters. Hardly anyone. Obligations. Ah, everyone's more towards the tax focus, so that's not going to help our levies, is it? Let's try and get this up a bit. Everybody, please vote. Let me see if I can... Creative Council support. I can negotiate an on aggression pact. Oh, sure. Jory Cassell, request Council support. No. Howland Reed. This guy, you. Non aggression pact? I mean, sure. Albar? No, he doesn't want to do anything. Dominic Belt? No. This guy, request Council support. No. Okay, so we might not even get through this law. I hope we do, because more levies is, of course, useful. Right, so we have a non-aggression pact with Sky, I don't know how. Oh, you lost. Ha! Ha ha ha. Aaron. Rog on. Oh, it uh, sucks to be you, mate. It also sucks not to have my islands. These are my islands. I won them, fair and square. I may have given up the twins, but that was my own, that was my own choice. I'm probably already in position to have a go at her now. Yeah, it's a wise choice indeed, my good man. You. you. Can't actually attack them. Am I here? The time has come. We're going to sneak into her castle and we're going to take care of this woman. Challenge her. Attack. She's no match for my might. Strike. Die. Lady Paramount has been slain. Excellent. Victory is mine. Yes, yeah, this is a very prestigious battle, wasn't it? Now, sometimes you have to use your imagination when doing stuff like that. This sort of roly blady sort of stuff. Looks like House Tully, with a Tyrell heir, is lord over there. And we have a Tully with a hunter heir over here. Issued by King Robert to the Iron Throne, really? Oh, yes, of course, I remember. I have Dynastic Stability on, so hopefully it will hold something. Or maybe somebody will take over that land. I don't know. I do know that sisters should be mine. So, ever so badly. Right, so we've got important decisions available still. She's declared Riverlander DJ War on Christian on Merits. Yes. It's about time you guys started clearing up your borders. 
Like, seriously. The Veil should do the same against these guys. Is it still House Martell? Yes, it is. And only have 18,000 men. If they were to try and take over this, it would be relatively easy. Who's this? He's got white hair. Is he a Dane? Is he something else? He's a Targaryen. Son of Viserys, who died in the dungeons of Septon of the Kingswood. Okay, do I have wards? I don't have any wards. I'm going to take a ward. There might be one already in my... Court says Frey still. Jeez, Will Eddard. Rickyon. My other son, Educate Child. Uh, Brandon by Rickon. Lovely. I also have other kids who deserve... Guys, Benjin, my nephew, gets him educated by somebody of note. Roger Dustin. Howland Reed. Bartimus Mormont. Edric Mormont. You know what's going with Edric Mormont? That might even get his relations up. Edric of Bear Island. Does that actually affect his relations at all? Uh. Prestige, Freedom of Fighter. No, it doesn't look like it. These guys have when we have the uh, betrayal. Yes? Yeah, range betrayal, that's, that helps a lot. Prince Eddard. Soon, Eddard. Soon. Captain Household Guard, is that a kid? Wait, Bartimus Snow? Ah, oh, they've taken away his Mormont. So, Edric. Does your brother not deserve your name? Of course they won't because he is a uh, House Quinnipus. Or well, he's a guy who's had an heir. So that, of course, takes it away. But let's actually give him his own his own Mormon sigil if we can find the bear. I doubt I'll be able to find the bear. There is so much going on here. Quinnipus. What a stupid word. It's got to be the bear. If I could find the bear, that would be so great. Wait, oh, wait. Oh, his, his colours are terrible. I'd probably do it do, uh, inverted. If I did find the correct thing for him. Come on, where's the Walmart's bear? I've got to do this now. I can't not do it. It just has to happen. It has to be a thing. Where is the bear? The bear, a bear, the maiden bear. Oh, yes. I just watched uh, Game of Thrones episode 4. And it was so funny seeing uh, Tormund and Brienne, or Tormund dying, not Brienne, that was, that was top quality. Top quality stuff right there, it has to be the bear, where's the bear? Bear, the bear, the main affair, what are we here? There were some animals there. No bears, no main affairs, just donkeys and stuff. Right, come on, seriously. What was that? There's a rabbit. Ah. I just, I've got to. This can't not. Oh, look what I found. A bear. Right. Black with a green bear, I think, is inverted. I think that's the inverted Mormont. Yes, that's green with a black bear. This is black with a green bear. So he's a bastard house of Mormont, yes? Quinip Quinn Pass. No, you are house. Uh, what is his mother? His mother is just Imgard. Bartmont. It's Mormont. What would you call a bastard line of house Mormont? What would it be? Mormont. Montmore? House Montmore. Yes, I am house Montmore. No, name it after something of this character. Strongmont? Oh, Smallmont. No! See, the Car Starks are Starks of Carl, of Carl's Hold. This is Bartimus. This is Bartmont. How's Barmont? Barmont. Mormont, Barmont. Yes, Barmont. There we go. House Barmont. It is a cadet branch of House Mormont. It is, the bear is different, yes, I know, but as we'll have to do for now. He's married to a Hulland. Another house I've made. Okay, well, sorry that took so long, but yeah. This stuff's got to happen. So here we have it. 
Chael Barmont. You'll be needing a betrayal. Maybe I have somebody in my court. I have a niece. Another bastard Stark. Well, there you go. Drove to her. You'll be trained in the art of the struggle. Yes. Oh, there we go. They rejected my law. No one I've got no levies. They won't let me have any. Bastards. Not talking about bastards, I was just working on Bartimus Barmont. Yes. How's Barmont? He'll probably ask for legitimization, but I'll have to turn him down. Right, what have we got here? Writer's Bridgman on Carwin. Ah! How's Carwin? Well, it looks like somebody wants to revolt. Just in time for a new house to be landed. Right, raise the men, surround them. Surround the fools. Right, so if we got we got me. I will lead. Give me Bart. I must give me Edric. Peter, yes. Aethon, yes. Morgan, yes. Why have I got Aethon? Anyway, let's go. 24th of July, 9th of July, X. And we're going to get here and we're going to smash them, I'm sure. Oh, good. I should have saved after finding that, uh, that bear. Oh, uh, why did I not do that faster? And off we go to fight House Carwin, who's decided that a new house would rule their name, their their land. They they just decided. I don't know why they decided it, but they did. All right, we've landed. Lord Carwin here. What if I were to challenge you to fight to the death on the battlefield? Send my challenge. He's no match for my might. Strike. Die! Lord Benjin Carwin is slain. Victory is mine. Evelynia was stronger, yes. We've slain him on the battlefield, leaving nine members of House Carwin. A woman, currently the head of the house. Well. Wow. We don't take too kindly to treachery. We saw 600 of men there retreating to Winterfell, or at least in that direction. No. Rickon, ah, Bartimus, we're going to stay here, we're going to siege out the castle. We are a wrathful man. We are a cruel, wrathful man. It's as if we would take over a house that's not all of the inhabitants, is it not? This seems like the kind of guy we might be. Strike fear in our, in our enemies. Anyway, what is this? Where is the of... Here's my general. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you for watching. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.